Hey, what's going on everyone? My name is Cap and welcome back to the channel. I'll show you guys what I did real quick. I made myself an improved heating element and made a whole bunch of steel and holy cow, having this thing in here, it makes it so that making forged steel only takes one second. So I'll put pretty much all the iron and clay I had in here made a whole bunch of forged steel, which is fantastic. And in order to be able to make that, I put my other skill point that I got into, where is it at? Tool crafting, I put it down here and that improved, that opened up the improved heating element option for me there and of course some of the other stuff I don't necessarily need. But anyway, what's up dude? I'm gonna leave you home for now, I'll come back for you later. At least I'm gonna try to do that. And also, for everybody that was concerned, I replaced the glass that I accidentally removed the other day. <laughs> so, it's good to go. I need to run over to the horde base. Oh wait, hang on. The other thing I did was I made some log spikes so I can take those over there. And I think I have everything with me that I need to take over to the base in order to be able to do stuff. You know what? I don't know if I have any forged iron. I don't even know if I need it or not. You know what? I'll take you because I don't know how much of that I have over there. And eh, mechanical parts. It's electrical parts that I need in order to be able to repair the electric posts over there. So I think I should be okay on that. See, food and water's okay, making sure we don't have any random hordes that have showed up just yet. A lovely gyrocopter that we didn't crash last time, lucky me. So it's day 60, which means it's horde night time. See, Big Mama staggering in from a late night of binge drinking. That's what she does. It's horde night, it's day 60, it's probably going to go just fine. I'm saying that with utmost confidence that I'm going to survive this without any problems. Whether I actually do or not remains to be seen. But I need to come over. I think the last thing that I need to get done is that I need to put down these spikes. And by the way, I can't remove this because this block right here is like a half block. And that is inside the block. I can't remove it. I've tried several different ways. It just will not go away. So for anybody who's just like, hey, if you move that one block out of the way, Cap, then you can do such and such. Yeah, yeah, that would be nice. But nope, I cannot. All right, so let's get a few random blocks put down here. All right, I don't have enough iron to upgrade these one higher than that. I believe I have some iron up here. I'm going to go up here and see, of course. I think I have everything else as about ready to go as it needs to be. Actually, I need to top you off just a little bit since I have some of my forged steel. There's a few of the ladder bits up here that I did not get a chance to top off yesterday when we were doing repairs. Careful. Because I didn't have any more forged steel with me. I left it all at the house. I don't remember if I have any more iron in here. Do I? I do not. I do have electrical parts, so you I'll put in here, just kind of keep those stacked up. I do have some more log spikes that I could probably put some more on the ceiling. Uh, let's see, I have ammo and things. I'll bring some more ammo over here and first aid supplies and things like that. I don't have any more. It's surprisingly how low I am on iron, considering how much I've had. But again, I did just make a tremendous amount to uh, forge steel, and that took a lot of it. So I think this place is ready to go. I think so. I don't want to do that, but I'm going to anyway, just to make sure that one stays nice and stable. Having a no backing on the ladder here. Hang on, wasn't there a spot down here? Wait, go up a little bit. All right, the bottom level of this ladder is pretty much good to go. I'm not going to worry about... Okay, I'm going to go ahead and fix that. I'm not going to worry too much about a lot of this part of right over here. Uh, let me get these topped off just real quick. I don't necessarily have to have them there specifically. They're not really doing me too much good, but I'll get them topped off just so there's one less place for them to get stuck in. That should do okay. If I can get some more iron, which should be pretty easy to come about, then I can get all these upgraded. Uh, let's see. I definitely don't want to get rid of the stairs. I've had to use those in the past to, eh, let's just say, to very quickly evacuate an area. Calm down, calm down. All right, so I think that's about it for what I can do over here right at the moment. I feel like the Horde base is ready to go for tonight. Is it? Eh, I don't know. We'll find out. So we're just going to kind of do our dilly-dallying of things, see if I can gather some resources laying around in different places. Big Mama still hasn't made it home. Um, and then we'll be ready to go over there. Try not to do too much on an actual Horde day just because, you know, bad things happen. And the vehicle stopped working at such and such a clock, and I definitely don't want to be trapped. So what I'm going to do for the moment is I'm going to throw all of this stuff in here so I can quickly access it here in a little bit. And I think, let me go ahead and put you up here as well just in case. All right, so day 60, it's been, I don't even know how long it's actually been. I want to peek my head downstairs real quick. And uh, because, you know, this place resets its loot every seven days, I think is what it actually resets to, if I can remember correctly. 
And I haven't been down here in a little bit, so I just want to quickly jump in and the main loot room that's down here, I want to see if it happened to refill anything. Now, all of this didn't, so I'm, I'm, I'm assuming because it's just real close to the top. But I believe all the stuff down here, and there's some locked chests, there's some uh, gun safes, there's all kinds of fun stuff down here. So I definitely want to try and get it. Plus, extra gas is always nice, so I don't have to try and make it myself. Let's gather up all the gas real fast. Okay, that's all the gas. Not too bad. An extra 300 and 337. I'm not sure if that was actual words or not. 377 is what I was going for. What are you? Vehicle reserve fuel tank mod? That could be lovely. And a titanium pickaxe? I mean, I'm rocking the steel one. Let me see. That one does 73.5. This one does 100. Uh, yeah, that's fantastic. All right, well, let's see what it gave us here. We got another one. This one was laying down here. This one's actually better than that one. That one does the same block damage as this one, but this one's a higher level. Let's see, scrap you, get a little bit more notes. We got two vehicle reserve fuel tank mobs. So that's not bad. I can put one on both of the vehicles they use all the time. We got motorcycle handlebars. We got a better sledgy. This one can actually hold a few more mods. So I might replace the one that's at the base with this one. Lovely, absolutely lovely. Uh, any of these desks searchable? No. All right, I'm not going to spend a tremendous amount of time down here. This one doesn't reset, but these do. So let's see what we got in here. Oh, that's just lovely. Another rad mover mod, a dulcher, ammo, lock picks, water purifier mod. That's just stuff and things. Let me see. So you and you, I'll scrap. We got some free money. Ammo's good. It's always good to run down here every, every once in a while. Some military gloves, probably better than the ones I have. Bunch more treasure maps. That's just lovely. Barrel extender mod. I could put that on my Winchester, maybe. Titanium knife. Not as good as the one I have. And more stuff. Urban combat. Bladed weapons. I'll just scrap you for the notes. Can sell that. Titanium plated Kevlar vest. Military leg. Oh, that's just good stuff. Oh, that's just good stuff. See, that's why I come back down here every couple days. Or about once every 20 days, I guess. Just completely get all kinds of chonky full of stuff. Reinforced club. That one's a 39. One for, I could use that one to repair the one I have at least. Oh, lovely. Absolutely lovely. This was absolutely worth coming down here. Uh, we have not been back to the bookstore since day 42. Uh, just because we haven't. I'm, I haven't been worried about trying to make any... Uh oh any of my own master class books just because they're so freaking expensive in terms of resources. What's up, dude? Getting a little bit of a frame drop. I'm not quite sure why that was moving so slow. Big Mama's finally made it over here. Yeah, moving a little bit slow. You've been drinking a lot today, lady? We are plus 10 on the chunky scale, and I'm okay with that because that's all good stuff. Oh, man. Love going down there. Right, let me drop a few things off in here. Right, that's good stuff. We got a bunch of stuff to sell in there. Dropped everything off from what we had going on over there. That's just absolutely lovely. So here's what I am going to do. I'm going to take a couple of these treasure maps. We're going to read these. I'm going to go do these. Like I said, for Horde Nights, we try to keep it kind of low-key because I don't want to get too involved in anything or risk dying or having to waste a tremendous amount of ammo just to be able to get through basic level missions right before Horde Nights shows up. Now right, let's get both of these red and see which one's going to be the closest. Whoa, calm down. So we got this one and the, okay, so we'll go to this one first because that one is the closest and you're going to be straight north, right? Are you going to be past the end of town? Right on the very edge of it. Nice. Not too bad. We can haul some biscuits over there. I'll worry about doing the uh, swapping over of tools and getting all my stuff that I need to moved over. All the stuff I just got, I'll worry about actually equipping that and moving that and putting some mods on some things before the actual Horde Night starts. Uh, so I just kind of threw it all into my dump chest right at the moment so we can continue on with the gameplay. But guys, we are on day 60. I am very, very thankful for everybody who's still here. I really, really am. And for all of you who have stuck with me through 60 videos of this. There's a fence. And our shenanigans. I do appreciate that. So, you know, if you're here and you enjoy it, as always, you know, leave a like on the video. It helps out a lot. Leave a comment. It helps out even more. And know that I truly do appreciate when you guys show up and show some love on the videos. Thank you very, very much for it. So we're going to come over. We're going to dig up a hole. Don't hit a tree. Yeah. Never blind, never ride blindly at full speed through the trees. Oh, somebody told me that I should slow down. Why would I do that? We don't got to go fast. Why would I want to slow down? 
Slowing down is how you get caught by the zombies, and I don't want to get caught by the zombies. I want to go fast. If I run into things, yeah, that's unfortunate. But, you know, it's it's what we signed up for. Can I grab you from right here? There we go. See if we can get this on the first try. First try. What you got for us? Ammo and stuff. Nice. That's usually what I get out on these uh, treasure quests. Treasure chest quests. <laughs> Can't talk today, but that's okay. And let's see, Mark, you is active, and where you is on the map. You're in the complete opposite direction, down there by past Trader Wrecked. Well, it's a good thing we've got a whole bunch of time to go here. So let's see if we can skirt around the outside of town. Maybe we can not run into any buildings. Oh, that was a small little lag spike. <laughs> and by the time everything popped in, uh, yeah, things went kind of bad there. So let's go over here and dig up this other one. Well, that's probably not the uh, easiest way to go about doing this, but we did get up here eventually. There's a small house over. Have I been down here? There's a small thing right there. I don't necessarily know what it is. One of the things that I've noticed is in the dirt bike is when you catch some extreme air, which I thoroughly enjoy, by the way, when you catch some extreme air, you uh, do not maintain your speed at all. It's like the longer you're in the air, the slower you go. So... You catch some serious air going full speed, you get some air, you get some distance there, but by the time you actually hit the ground, you've pretty much lost all the momentum and speed you did have. It's uh, it's one of those that I, I wish it didn't do that. First try again, what you got for us? More ammo and a compound crossbow? Well, we're using a titanium. Let me see, that one does 60.3, this one does a whole lot more, but I appreciate all the ammo. Nice. All right, I want to go see what this little location is right up the top of this hill here. Uh, we also hit an imaginary dirt block that wasn't connected to anything. And uh, we took a little bit of damage in our vehicle, but that's really shocking to nobody. All right, what is this place? What is this POI called? Uh, Shamway Production Plant. Huh. Is that a white? Hang on, you got the click. Yeah, that's white. A mutated white. Shh. Be quiet. A mutated white laying outside. I can't imagine... Oh, hell, I didn't even see this guy. Hey, you. Shh. Be quiet. I'm trying to take out your glowy buddies over here. Somebody looks like Charlie Daniels. Take a shot in the head. Boomskies. And there comes uh, Glenn over there. We'll worry about him in just a minute. What you got for me? Some more silver ammo and another adulterer. Hang on, we got Kyle sleeping right there. Go ahead and get rid of him. And he turned around like, nah, I'm good. I do not want any part of that. Come back here, sir. I was like, oh, hey, look, a guy. I didn't see you there. My bad. Let's peek our head in here real quick. I see Charlie again. It looks like, looks like a couple people. Yep, that's a dog. Is everybody just asleep? It's a good thing I got some Sneaky Pete stuff here. What? Are y'all dead? Oh, the dog is sleeping on his leg. Oh, how sweet is that? I'm sorry, dude. I had to. Oh, and there's a wolf right up there. Shh, you didn't see anything. That looks like Eddie. Yep, that, that's an Eddie. Shoot him in the back of the head. Looks like Frank's up there with him. There you are. Shh. Uh oh, hang on. Oh, we didn't get the sneak damage on you because you woke up before I had a chance to do anything to you. But you brought me some loots, and that's what I appreciate about you. I don't want your pants. I'm going to take your pants anyway just because you're offering them to me, but I don't want your pants. I don't know what kind of nasty stuff you've been doing in here. All right, Frank, let's see if we can get a headshot. Nice. Perfect timing. Where's your head? I don't think he has one. There we go. Give him a chance to explode. Hey, you got any eggs for us? Nope, just a couple feathers. We're good on feathers. I will go ahead and take your meats. Thank you, thank you. It'd be great if I could get any of my bolts back, but that's not a thing in Darkness Falls. Oh, hey. What's up, dog? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I apologize. Y'all were just up here taking a nap. I kind of feel bad. Kind of. What do you got in your box for us here? Stuff and random crap. Okay, nothing great. Supplies. Eh, it's not bad. It's not terrible. Oh, hey. That's a dire wolf. How about we... 
do that real quick. Didn't even see. I don't know where you were. You were not in here a minute ago. I can say that for certain that you were not in here. I don't know where you came from, though. I'll leave your sandwich behind. Nothing in the nothing in there. It's a vending machine with stuff and things. Nice. Tell you what, I'll go ahead and just take that. I'll eat that. I'll use your orange marmalade and take your peas. Go ahead and take that as well. Nice. Okay, we got a boar sleeping right there. Well, I could probably get a... Yeah, headshot that way. All right, that's good over here. I'm not seeing any other animals up here. That's some free meat. Hang on. I'm porking right at the moment. You're going to have to just wait a second. Gary, you sneaking up on me like that? That's rude, dude. Rude. Where did you even come from? You were like right around the corner here. All right. Let's go upstairs and see if there's any more dogs up here. Oh, hey. What in the sweet jeebus? That's not a dog. Why are there two graces up here? Y'all are terrifying. Very, very close. I'm not going to tell you. I'm not going to lie. Can you move out the way? I can't see if there's anything up here besides the ammo. Um, you're kind of blocking like everything here. What do we got? Random box in the corner. That's all you had. A die here. I don't think I can get anything good from these. Let me see. Can I? Oh, okay. You're gone. And you're gone. Oh, nice. 296 meats. That's absolutely worth the price of admission. Heck yeah. Thanks, Grace. Appreciate that. So this is where they do all the packing and the processing of all the foods. And I see where they get it from. Got some ginormous boars up top. All right. Uh, let's make sure things are reloaded. We have been just firing all willingly. We're good. We're good. Whoa, that's cool looking semi. That's that's cool. That's a good way to use the assets that are available here. What you got in here? Water cooler. Nice. Coffee maker. Did you make me? You didn't make me any coffee at all. That's just messed up. Go ahead and rip that apart just for the little bit of extra iron you can get from there. Shamway food. All right. I'm going to assume. Things are terrible inside there. How do I get in there without having to... How, how do I get in there? Hey, what's up, dude? Come here. Do you know where the front door is to this place? I don't know how to get in there without making a bunch of noise. I guess... Oh, hail to the no-no. Go ahead. How'd that work out for you? There's the dog pound. Go ahead and get rid of you. Shoot you in the butt talks. Move. I'm trying to hit the other guy. Move. Okay. No. Why can't I? There's one laying down right back over there. I cannot seem to hit him because this one's right in the way. Uh-huh. I'm, I'm literally leaning forward on my desk right at the moment. Oh, hang on. We got a purple dude. This won't kill him, but it should piss him off just a little bit. And it looks like a angry dog right there. That shot. Just a whole bunch of them too. You know what? If y'all are if y'all are just gonna hang out inside here, I'm just gonna go ahead and do that. Alright, well let's climb up here and see if there's anybody up here worth messing with. What is going on right there? That looks like a bear! Oh god! Up there's a bar. <laughs> it's a good thing I saw that. All right, so this these idiots ought to be coming over here shortly. Anybody else? No, that's my step, sir. Would you bring me at least key cards and hazmat fiber? And some shotgun shells. Nice. Since we used a couple of those on the bear that kind of surprised us a little bit. Is everybody in here dead yet? Let's do a quick run through. Hello? Wow, look at all these shamway boxes. Okay, we're going to finish looting the trailer first. <laughs> look at that pile of bodies. That's just lovely. All right, so let's see. I think an axe is the best. 
thing to chop down these real quick so I can get inside. That's a zombie bear, so I'm not going to get anything good from him. Hidden stash with rocket, polymer string. Uh, okay, it's okay stuff. It's not the best stuff in the world, but it's okay. It's cement mixer and some actual cement. That's cool. Mr. Byer, were you hiding anything else back here? This is a pretty good sized trailer. I have to assume you got some more back here with you. That's it? They put a bear in here to guard two boxes? There's like 75 dogs in here guarding all the food. Okay, sure, why not? Well, let's just go ahead. This is a good way to loot or get some supplies now. Cardboard box with... Yeah, sure, why not? All of your lockers are garbage. If you could find me like a bunch of random iron, that would be good. And also, what I was doing when I was making all the forged steel and I needed some more iron um, was I was like going through, I had a bunch of nails that I could scrap down and I did that. Scrapped a bunch of just random pipes that I had laying around. Just random supplies of things that I had laying in the box that I could scrap for some extra iron. And even then, I kind of ran out. So I'm going to be getting nothing besides food supplies and all these, but you know what? Who can complain about that? Let's get all these cracked open. I hear the sound of somebody walking around. Uh-oh. That doesn't sound good. What's up, dog? That sounds like a bar. No, no, no. That sounds like a... That's a bar. What kind of place is this? Hey, Mare. You know what? You know what? I'm not going to give you a chance to get out there, Mr. Fire. And I think I see an exploding dog here. Nope, that's a... Uh, that's... Uh, yeah, that's... That's another boss, lady. Okay, look, I need you to move your guts up out the way here. I can't see anything. You're... Yeah, I'm encumbered. Imagine that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, puppers. Okay, let's uh, let's try this like this. This could be dangerous, or it could be really, really useful. Who knows? Okay, the bear's dead. Big babe, the blue ox. Is everything else in here dead? I was trying to break down that little bit right over there. I can get that, but I can't get the other stuff. These tiny little things right here are giving me a little bit of iron. The reason why I'm busting those down. Not a lot, but every little bit helps. What's up, bear? Were you hiding anything over here? Wait, where did this door go? How did I even miss this door? God, I'm glad I did. If I'd opened the door from that side, that would have sucked. I would have been all kinds of exposed. And that would not have been cool for me. All right, well, this place is kind of fun. Didn't know this place even existed. And here we are just absolutely wrecking things. <laughs> Finish searching all the crap that's in here. More supplies, that's nice. Some food in the corner. A little bit of dried fruit. Okay. All the lockers are still taken apart. Uh, breaking apart the table doesn't really give me that much for how long it takes to do it. So I'm not going to spend a lot of time on those. These all still need to be opened up. And then we're going to have to run to the house and drop all the... Hello? Drop all this stuff off before the horde night starts. We got all these pallets we need to break down. Well, if you're looking for a good place for food supplies, this definitely looks like the place to go. Cardboard box with some more supplies. Level 70 and I got two skill points. Nice. I have good places I need to put both of those. I'm not going to worry about it right this second, though. I believe I got everything. I'm not seeing anything else. Wait, how do I get up there? Hang on, let's see if I can just do it the, uh, the old-fashioned way. A little nerd pull in here. See if there's anything even up here. There has to be. Probably something terrifying, too. Yep. Oh, crap. You are thirsty. Stupid birds! Why are there birds up there in the loft? No! Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Holy monkey. I knew there was something. I even called it. I even said, hey, by the way, there's probably something terrible up here. Hang on, where's some of that uh, marmalade here? That That's good. Yeah, we'll go ahead and use you. Oh, that's orange tea. Same thing. Marmalade, it's orange. Oh, hey, what's up? Sorry, dog. I didn't even see you there. My bad. We are still super chunky, but water's okay now. Now let's go see what's back here. More food supplies. Just fantastic. This is, this is a loot place for the ages here, man. I'll take you. Leave the nasty meats behind. 
All right, well, let's finish gathering up all this stuff. As far as I can tell, that's everything that's up here. Look, we are, we're really on the chonky side, but we got a bunch of just random crap. What are you? Hops flower, I don't need you. I'll leave you behind, that'll remove one thing of chonkiness for us. Yeah. This was a, oops, this was an interesting little POI to stumble upon. Hey, we got some experience. Hang on, I gotta get my life bar back. There we go, I had to do a quick pause. By the way, if you're playing this and you didn't hear me talk about it in a previous video, or whatever, if you're playing Darkness Falls and you get the little glitch where your health and life bar disappears down there, just pause the game and then unpause it, it comes back. I've seen it happen a few times. Uh, usually, I think if it does that when I'm like using the tablet or something, I don't necessarily know why it does that, but it's not that big a deal. So, we have a tremendous amount of food supplies. We got some experience, got some skill points, I got some stuff at the house I need to use, uh, like tools-wise. Double check to see if any of the armor I got in the last location is any better than what we currently have. This was, That was a fun one. And we still gotta go do the Horde Knight. Yay! <laughs> I'm not really looking forward to the Horde Knight. But, okay, look at that. We barely, barely did that. We barely hit that. So anyway, here's what's going to happen. I'm going to run home. I'm going to drop off all this stuff and get everything ready to go. We don't have a whole lot of time left before the Horde Night starts. I need to make sure I'm close to the house before my motorcycle dumps me out and then won't take me home any further. So we're just going to pause right here, and I'll be back in just a tiny little bit when it's time for the Horde Night. All right, it is time. Let's see where we are. We are at 2,025 kills, game stage 258. I'm at level 70. Yay! I'm going to guess I get 100 125 kills our electric fence and sledgy does a big chunk of it so i'm leaving it kind of up to him i think we're ready to go i hope we're ready to go um i did have one or two pieces of armor that i had found yesterday or yesterday earlier in our uh, travels that's better than what i was currently rocking so there's that i did remember to remove the blocks over there for my little bridge that i was using to go back and forth so guess we'll see who's gonna be the first one up the ladder it looks like tom are you stuck, sir? Figure it out. All right, and there's the glowy ones. We got a football player. We got Blobby. Here comes all the big guys. There's a... Okay. I don't think I will. And first one down is absolutely wrecked already. Lovely. That's just what I love to see. Just go ahead and kind of clear some of this up a little bit. Don't want people exploding. That's just lovely. We'll let Slade you do some work for sure. That's a big old beefer right there. Zombie Titan. Hey, what's up? Go ahead and just, uh, I don't see any tracks around here. Well, what about this big mamma jamma right there? You. You're, you're blocking the lane here, sir. You need to either figure it out or die or something here. Yep, yeah, we're getting some big beefers up in here. The Titans. Trying to get rid of the guys that explode. We got some tough boys up in here. Dude's missing his head. Big Tom right there. All right, let's double check to make sure everything didn't do anything stupid while y'all are over here. Okay, you're good. You're good. You're... I don't think I will. I mean, at least I'm going to... Holy cow. For a second, I thought that was a ginormous Big Mom. Ooh, that was a red bag. Excuse me. Got to pause. Hang on. There we go. Oh, I wanted to get the loot bag beforehand. Straight up just wrecking you guys. Wrecking it. I hear you, bird. Go away. Shh. Another big beefer. Shoot you right in the butt talks. Don't see any tracks around. Well, that's probably a good thing. Nutshot. Headshot. We got, we got all kinds of zombies up in here. And our shotgun's just straight beasting it like normal. Looks like that dude fell off. He's all right. He made it back up. Actually, you know what? Let's save a few shotgun rounds because that works good for up close and personal combat. It's just going to fire blindly into this body that's right here in front of me. There's two big beefers in here. Big Chungus is causing, some, causing an uproar. That's a lot. Birds, leave me alone, dude. You're being really loud and obnoxious. Stop it. Shh. I'm trying to kill actual zombies. You're just kind of an annoyance. Shoot you right in the nards a few times. We're just going to dead fire right in the middle. Ooh, nice. Another big orange bag. That's lovely. 
I, should, I need to make a bigger magazine for this gun. I'm not sure if I have one on there or not. I'm not sure if I have one or not. Level 71, baby! Absolutely lovely. Sledgy setting some people on fire. Hold on, let's check the uh, durability of some things real quick. Go ahead and top you off. Oh, hey, you're getting a little close there, Chief. Let's see here. Let's look down there. You're okay. Got some whites up in here. Brittany's bringing some loots. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Can I get rid of these zombie bodies laying here? Hey! What the hell hit me? Oh, was it you? You big jerk. Hang on, gotta reload. Birds need to leave me alone. Go away. There you go. I was trying to get rid of the bodies that are floating there just because they're causing the idiots over here to mess up their pathing, and I don't really like that. Nope. Lots of whites. Hello? Okay, we're good. Somebody else threatening me with suffering. That's like the fourth Titan, I think. That's not too bad. That's not too bad. As long as we can keep the durability of things put together, we should be all right. Get rid of him because he's blocking the path. I don't know where he went. Okay, y'all are all good for a second. And let's lead you do some work here and I'll check the repair levels. Ooh, hang on. I need to check repair level of my fence. Top you off. We're good. All right, let's see you. Go ahead and show you some love. Don't hit me. You're doing okay. Outside bars are doing okay. Let's see, walls doing okay. Stairs. Uh, no, you're a body. Hang on, I can't get rid of you real quick. Blubby! I need you to go away. Yeah, having all these big boys in this tiny little narrow corridor, they just, they're just like, I can't hit him because I can't get close enough. <laughs> Uh, excuse me, you're kind of in the way. Both of y'all are. Hang on, I'm gonna reload. There's Blubby. Stop puking at me, Blubbies. Ooh, drop loot. Oh, I missed it again. Dang it, I was hoping I could get that. Is that another Titan? Kind of looks like it. Yep. Did I see a demolition zombie show up in that list of names with it? That's a few Titans. That's a few titans right there. I just noticed, uh, a little late to me to do anything about it right this second, but I just noticed I don't have my carp, uh, my uh, coil weapons with me. <laughs> We're just gonna do this the old fashioned way then, I guess. That's, uh, that's not how I wanted to do this, but that'll work out. That's a lot happening right over there for sure. You are a big ugly mug. Okay, these Night Stalkers, I definitely got to get rid of because they do some damage. That looks fun. I wonder. I wonder. Hang on. I can't feed it through the bars. <laughs> of course I set myself on fire. Why wouldn't I? Stupid. I was hoping that would set some of them on fire. Kind of looked like it did. You will suffer. I know. You keep saying that. Uh-oh. There's Carl. Got to get rid of the. Got to get rid of the. Uh, these guys down here, the little guys, because they do some damage to these bars. Okay, you're okay. Yeah, get him, Sledgy. Get him. Kick his a. All right, so we got this gun. Also helps out with it because this also stops. I have the Blessed Metal mod on certain things, and that helps out with doing uh, more damage to demons, and it stops their health regeneration. But there's just a lot going on right over there. Hang on. Can y'all leave me alone? Stupid birds. The only reason I have that hatch there is so I can shoot y'all. I need you to hit all the spikes that's over there. That would help me out a lot. Okay. What you doing? How'd you get over here? No? You didn't hit my fence, did you? Rude. Alright, you're good. Okay, so we got... The stairs are gone, but that's okay. We can do... You know what? Hang on. I could probably fix that real quick. Let's see, shapes, uh, stairs, rotate you around, put you right there, upgrade you a few times. There we go. Now you got now you got stairs to get to me again. That looked like a demon. How are you getting over here? Hang on, I'll let you in just a second. Stop hitting my door. 
What'd you bring me? Uh, a little bit of Kevlar. That's it, huh? All right, health is doing okay. Water's getting a little bit low, but not low enough to start complaining about being thirsty yet. There's a demon. Demon Brittany, yeah! What we like to see. Anybody else out there? Nah, we're good. Sledgy's still doing work. Tripwire's still doing work. Just keep on keeping on, Sledgy. You're doing a good friggin' job. Them big guys take up a lot of space on the screen here. Y'all keep dropping that loots too here. Yeah, y'all keep dropping that loots. Just checking to make sure nobody else is getting over here. Sledgy, you're doing a dang good job. Man, y'all are moving fast. Super de duper fast. Don't do it. Don't do it. All right, we'll give a chance to kind of check on things. You're all right. You're hey, you kind of startled me. I'm not gonna lie. Let's see here. Can top you off a smidge. Top you off. Let me check out the ceiling. A few idiots like to bounce up top a little bit and hit some things. You're okay. Hello? Don't know what that sound was. It sounded like it came from behind me. <laughs> I don't think so. No sneaking up from behind. Oh, hey. You better not glitch through the bars. That would be totally unprofessional. We don't do that around here, sir. We don't do that around here. No glitching through the bars, because then I have to retreat down to the other room. I don't have Sledgy to help me. It'd just be bad for business all around. I don't know how much that one has left. There's a lot of Titans. There's a lot of Titans. Alright, that one's gone. Hang on, go to reload. Wow! We got some big demons. We got some more Titans here. Ooh, that one's almost dead. Okay, that one's dead. and We're good. Good. Birds, I hear you up there. I don't see you just yet. There you are. Hang on. Got him. Level 72. Whew. Okay, we're doing good. We're doing good. We're doing good. We're doing good. I get a little nervous using my Molotovs because I can't throw them through the bars. I'm not about to go outside. That's where the stupid birds are. And uh, the stupid birds show up and they start knocking me off. And that's our only death so far in this game is... The horde knot that the stupid bird knocked us off. That's the only one. Uh oh, it's sparking here. Hang on, gotta repair you. You're okay, you're okay, you're okay. There you go. Keep doing your thing. Keep doing your thing. Let's check the durability. You're okay. Go ahead and top you off a smidge. We're good. Oh, hey! Knock you all the way backwards into another block, sir. Football player, you need to die so you can stop making all these idiots sprint so much. I mean, they're already running, but now they got, like, superhuman speeds. Showing up faster than the game can render them. This is going well. Don't say that, Cap. Don't say that. No words. Don't say words. I'm just go shoot him in the nuts until he dies. Uh-oh. Hang on. Oh, okay. Sledgy, you are a force to be reckoned with. Don't ever let me tell you differently. I wonder... I wonder if I could get a Molotov in there without falling off. Nope. Nope. We can't. Hang on. Idiot. See, that's why I don't use Molotovs very often. Because I'm not going to get close enough to the ledge to get away from some stuff. But I'm also not going to be dumb enough to... Uh, yeah, let me repair you real quick because you get a little bit low. Uh, let's see. I need to get rid of that guy over there. He's got a lot of life. He can't seem to make it up the ladder. Oh, hey, this one did, though. Later, Carl. Got some blobbies. We can get, get rid of these guys that explode. I don't want them blowing up and doing damage to things and leaving little puddles of nastiness all around us. All right, well, y'all are getting juggled. Let's check on the durability of things. Let me fix you. Go ahead and top you. Oh, hey, excuse me. Sledgy, I need you to start setting some people on fire. Okay. Yep, you fall down there. 
Yep, you fall down there too. Looks like Titan dude got tired of going up that one set of stairs and he couldn't. He can't figure it out. He's stuck over there. I think he's too big to get through the blocks. Yeah, he can't get past that walkway that's up there, and so he's just like crawling in a row. He's not as smart as his buddy is over here to keep running around. Look how fast these guys are running, man. Sledgy, you are an absolute beast, sir. None of that. No, don't be blown up. None of that. None of that. None of that. We got an hour to go. You know what? Hang on real quick. Just because I keep doing dumb things here. Uh, let me use you. I've got a couple of these extra ones here I could use. Go ahead and use you and use the other one. Get the health back up a little ways. Let me get some red tea in me. That should be good. That should be good. Roar to you too, sure. I'm going to just sit here and just shoot on your nuts until you're dead. Yeah, I probably should have brought some of my coil weapons over here. That's a that's a live and learn sort of thing. Totally a live and learn thing. I thought I had them over here is the reason why. I even remember making a statement once before. I'm like, I need to go get my coil weapons from over at the Horde base and use those for my normal stuff. You can see how well I did that. All right, let's check on that. Let's see, top you off. You're getting a little bit of love over here. You're okay. Check out the walkway. Sledgy, what are you doing? There you go. Take a little breather. It's okay. You have deserved the right to stop and take a breather every once in a while, sir. Go ahead and top you off. Top you off. And we're good. Back to killing idiots. Let's do it. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. There we go. Later, Blobby. Later, Sylvia. And there goes Eddie. See, I wish I could throw a Molotov through these bars, but I can't do it. And setting that idiot on fire is not really going to do anything anyway. Dang, that block took some damage right over there. Can I reach that? No, I can't reach that at the moment. Careful. Got to start to pile up again. None of that glitching through the bars crap. None of that. None of that. None of that. It doesn't help that I know I'm just blind firing here, so a lot of these damage on that block over there is me. Oh, there's a behemoth. Nice. I hadn't seen one of you tonight. Or at least I don't think so. Hang on, I gotta I gotta reload. Just a second. Uh oh. Don't hit the no-no button. Do not hit the no-no button. We are really close to bingo hour here. We're doing well. Let's not do anything stupid, okay? Yeah, let's just keep him downstairs. Hey, sir. 15 more minutes and the horde night's over. Then we just got to do cleanup. How am I on ammo? This gun's still got 900 rounds. We're still doing okay. So, all right, let's get rid of the behemoth. Behemoth is, uh-oh. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, my God. Holy sweet Jeebus. We barely got away from that one. He hit the button and I could not get away from that fast enough. Holy monkey. Uh... Wow, he did some damage. Okay, we got to do some repairs real quick. Sledgy, I hope... Are you okay? You're okay. All right, you're okay. Uh, I didn't mean to do that, but that'll work out here. Um, all right, they're still trying to come towards me. Hey, we survived the night. Let's see if I can fix this a little bit while Sledgy's doing his thing. Uh, copy rotation. Can I put you right next to it? Like right there? Like that? And then like right there? Right... Why can't I put anything there? Oh, it's because there's an idiot right here. Oh, man, that almost went bad real close to the end there, didn't it? Oh, I see another Kraken down there. Hang on, I got to fix this before I do anything else. Stop it. Stop it. Okay, y'all are okay. Uh, getting you upgraded is fine. Sledgy, you keep doing your thing. I'm going to finish working on repairing this if you'll just kind of uh, hold me. Wait, is my fence still here? No! Wow! You went ahead and ruined everything, didn't you? Man, that was that was real close. Things almost went a little sketchy there for a second. Hang on. Rotate, copy rotation. Why are you being dumb? Okay, 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 okay. Alright, let's uh let's top off some of the blocks that are still here real quick. Get you fixed. Alright, alright, so <laughs> That went, uh, that went really well. 
Uh, let's see. Check out our shapes. Let me see. Pole centered, I think, is the one I was using. Uh-huh. All right. Well, how about we worry about killing all these idiots? Actually, actually, how about we use another first aid kit? Oh, man. We got hit hard. We got hit real hard. You know, I'm going to go ahead and use another one. Get that extra 30 up there. All we have to do left is finish clearing out the idiots that survived. We had titans and behemoths and demons and all that. And what about ruined it? Freaking demo zombie. You got punched in the butt. Okay, we still got plenty of idiots around here to clear up for sure. Okay, he's down. We're not we're not out of the woods yet, but we're getting close. Cole, you missed the jump, sir. Hey, at least they're trying to jump this direction to me, so they just keep missing. That works. See if I can just shoot y'all off the ladder. Sylvia's gonna get punched in the butt too. Hey! What's up, girl? Alright, we're we're slowly getting there. A little bit of time. Nut shot for days. I'm, I have to wonder if there's a football player. There he is. I need to get rid of the football player. If he's not already dead. Because he's the one that's causing all them to sprint so much now. Making it hard to hit. Hey! Oh, you suck! Sylvia, cannot believe you did that. You jumped over and punched me. That's just rude. Straight rude, I tell you. Um, I guess I could turn you off. Because you're not connected to anything right at the moment anyway. Just save some batteries, you know. You need to die, sir. There we go. Now everything will run at at least a normal speed. Okay. Um, We have some zombies still. Ru hey, none of that. None of that. None of that. Get up. Good to go. I know there's a Kraken downstairs somewhere. I saw it just a minute ago. Gonna play some whack-a-mole. Oh, Sylvia's just like, hang on, he hit me. I'm gonna lay down for just a second. And he, she pushed, uh, she got pushed up the stairs. I see a bar. Okay, let's see if we can't. Do not set yourself on fire, Cap. Do not set yourself on fire. Yay, we didn't set ourselves on fire. Let's try another one. Uh, that works. What's in the loot bag? Uh, oh, nice. Stuff and some things. Okay, they can't get up over there. I'm going to guess there's some ladders missing. Ew. I hear some... Damn! Somebody got all squishy. Rawr. Oh, I was trying to hit him, you know, like a skeet shooting or whatever, and I missed. Uh, yep, I, I see some more crap down there. Hang on, I got an idea. I got an idea. Oh, please don't kill yourself, Cap. Please don't do it. Oh, hey, you jerk! Off the top rope, man. Could you not do just freaking jumped at me? All right, we got some zombie bears. Boom skis! Are you coming back up the ladder? Oh, you got the click. Hang on. Okay, I need you to calm your butt down, sir. Lois, you're a little late to the party. I'm going to go ahead and knock you off, too. Oh, uh, uh. sorry. Got a, <laughs> a little bit of a pucker there. Hang on. I got a couple more of these. See if we can ricochet it off that. Oh, that was a little preemptive there. All right. A uh, couple more zombies showing up down here. I've got a stack of these grenades I'm not using for anything else. So I'm just hoping it'll get rid of some of them. Another zombie bear. I'm pretty sure the uh, the uh, Kraken's still down there. I see a, a Titan right there, too. So I'm hoping that, you know, we can get rid of him real fast-like. Okay, let's check on ammo. Whew. All right, let's see what we can do here. Easy now. Easy. 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 Okay. 
All right, we're missing some ladders. That's why they stopped coming up this direction. There's missing some ladders that way. Let's see what we can see from here. A behemoth. You just stay down and let me keep shooting you until you're dead. Cool, cool. See a spider zombie moving around down there. That looks like Blobby. Demo zombie did some serious work when he blew up. Got another bar down there. Holy monkey. The base is still holding up. Okay, let's stop doing that, Cap. I don't know where he just went, but I think he's dead. Uh. Oh, hail to the no. I don't want to suffer. I've already suffered. Look at my base. You know how many resources it's going to take to fix this? Money, some supplies, stuff. That's okay. All right. Uh, let's see. Where did I put my tablet? I think I left it at home so I could use it to see if there's any zombies left around here. Because I guarantee there's probably a dog all up inside there. There always is. Whew. Okay. All right. We survived. We survived so far. Let me see where we are. I'm just going to close those and act like nothing happened real quick. Let's see where we are here. 2174, so 150 zombies that we killed, not counting what Sledgy and company did. Uh, I need to not do that. Hold on. Okay, before I put stuff up, let's go over there and double check to make sure that everything is actually dead. Make sure everything is... Calm down and make sure everything is actually gone. I need to replace the ladders real quick. Whew. Copy shape. Copy rotation. Slap you down right on right there. Okay, let's get you upgraded real fast. By the way, I do realize I have my... Oh, there's a bear right there. I do have my uh, multi-tool in my inventory right next to my nail gun. I'm aware. I see that orange bag. That's definitely a priority to get. Okay, this could be dumb. Let's reload real quick. Yeah, I hear you, dog. I don't know where the Kraken went. Shoot you in the butt talks. We've dealt with a lot of bears today. I'm sorry, bear. Easy does it. Easy. You just tiptoe down here. Zombie time. Are you trapped? Look around, keep an eye on things. We survived. Careful, easy does it. Let's not get too cocky yet. They definitely did some work to the towers, for sure. I'm just trying to make sure there's not any random dogs up there. Okay, I think we survived. Hang on, let's double check over here, make sure there's nothing. I know I saw a Kraken earlier. I guess daylight, another one, seriously? Good thing bears can't really climb that well. Level 73, five skill points to use. Okay, we got to get back upstairs and uh, drop off a bunch of this um, supplies though, so we can go get all this loot here. And just like normal, you know, we are, uh, our Horde Night uh, videos always go way long into the day. So the next video will be a much shorter one, but it's okay though. All right, so we're going to put... I'll keep that much on me. I am out of first aid stuff. All right. Well, at least I have my, I did bring my tablet over here so I can kind of look to see if there's anything else moving around. I don't see any. I can see all them loot bags down there. I want to go get though. Oh, wait, there's a couple flying. I'm guessing the game just doesn't know where that one's at. And so I was like, eh, we'll put it somewhere over here. Unless it's an actual bird. Okay. Well, looks like what we need to do is go get our loot. We'll worry about fixing this place up at a later date. That is not a problem for today. We got one more idiot downstairs. I'm hoping it's just a regular idiot. Nothing. You know what? Let's switch over to a gun once up. Just in case. Oh, it's Sylvia. Okay. All right. Let's go get the good bag first and see if we got anything lovely from there. There's two of them over here. Uh, titanium gloves and auto rifle stock. Nice. I think Sylvia heard us. We're getting the uh, the uncommon stuff here first. There we go. That's uh, that's three bags. No. None of that. 
None of that, lady. None of that. Screamer. We definitely don't need a screamer showing up at the end of the horde night. Calling in all our stupid buddies. Did you call in your buddies anyway? Look, I'm in the middle of trying to do something. Um, sir. I need you to stay down. Alright, well let's see how much of this loot that we can actually pick up here. I'm going to be chonky real, real fast. So let's do this. Okay, well so far... Uh, for Nat, I know you're in the comments keeping track of how many bags we picked up. I picked up 22 so far, and I am completely chonky. I'm going to have to run home and dump some stuff off real quick. Fortunately, I live real close by. If I go the right direction, it's even closer. Dump a... Jump a... Uh, drop a bunch of stuff off. That's the words. And then come back over in here and get the rest of it. Because we are full... All right, I think that's all the loot. I'm hungry. Yeah, I'm also very much encumbered here. Do I have... Let's see PB&J to celebrate having such a good horde night. Almost went terrible, but we survived. So, Nat, since you're keeping track of all the stuff and the counting of things here, that's 35 bags that were down there total we picked up. I'll get back to the house real quick and show you guys what I got. and You can kind of just glance over it. And then that's going to be the end of it. I'm going to have to spend some time organizing my chest because I just dumped everything in one of them and it's full of stuff. So here's everything that we have from the Horde Night. Pretty much everything from here down plus all the stuff that's in here. There's so much to have to go through. I'm going to have to, it's going to take me a while to go through all of this crap here. <laughs> but there you have it. Guys, that was another fantastic, a fantastic one. 2179. I don't know how many times we died. Don't know. Oh yeah, I forget to bring you with me sometimes. But guys, if you enjoyed it, do me a favor, leave a like on the video. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe if you're not already so you don't miss out on future videos. And in the meantime, you guys have a wonderful day, and I'll talk to you later.